This is a day in my life as a Wardstones bookseller. I walk to work each morning and grab a quick breakfast before heading inside to check out emails. Today's a really exciting day because we've just announced the shortlist for our children's book prize, which is voted for by booksellers like me. So the first thing I did was set up our table display, adding a table header and a banner to really help show it off. After that, it's time to decorate the window. So I cut out some clouds to write reviews on and decorated them with this cool silver paper before popping them in the window. The night before, I also made these really cute paper stars to hang up and here is the finished result. To carry on a very creativity-based morning, I then made a TikTok for our books of the month. I grabbed some similar titles for an if you like this, you should read this style video. Here is my super professional setup for that. Then I was thinking about how there's so many great new young adult books out right now, so I grabbed a bunch to take a nice flat lay picture of them for our shop Instagram. By the time I finished taking my pictures and putting all the books back, it was time for lunch. And what's a reader going to do on their break but read? I'm reading Howl's Moving Castle for the first time and hugely enjoying it so far. Back on the shop floor again, I noticed we had some gaps in our manga cabinet, so I made up a couple of new figurines to show off. It's something that I won't let anybody else do because I think it's so much fun. And here is all of them looking really nice together. By this point, our crying table was looking pretty depleted and needed some topping up from where customers have been shopping, so I grabbed some extra stock and with a couple of moves, it was back to being a beautiful pyramid. And then it was time to show off all the exciting new books we just had delivered. I wish it was actually as quick and easy as I've made it look here. I then spent a bit of time writing review cards for the books I'm most excited about. And then finally it was time to wave goodbye to all the books and head on home. When I got home I had some super exciting book posts waiting for me which is honestly one of the best perks of my job right here and that was my whole day.